we have a sea snake, it's washed up on the shore. They're not very, very good on land, so they can barely move. Um, this one probably either died from stranding or it died in the water. Because um, it's one of several species that occur in the area. Um, I'll look up the species and find it out for you. But you can see the paddle-shaped tail and the very, very flattened body, which enables them to swim in the water. They have a, a flattened uh, profile, so laterally compressed body, and that enables them to swim, swim sinuously through the water. Very interesting find this. You can actually see its anus or vent, I don't like that. So it's got a fairly short tail, um, bleeding from the mouth. It has been uh, eaten into from the side there, probably by a fish. You can see there's a hole on the side. But you can see the very, very flattened, laterally compressed body. And the short, relatively short tail, because that's where it starts, right at the cloaca, the vent. And um, it's called a cloaca because it's used for multiple purposes urination, defecation, and breeding. Um, either laying of eggs or um, mating. There we have it, one of the sea snake species. It's pretty cool.